Hmm. Where's Dan? Honest Dan. I'm hiding something. I'm sure of it. Hey, Dan. This whole yeah. place has got me on edge. Nope. Okay. Um. Jacob, I hope you're enjoying your stay. Yeah, I am. Uh, thanks. Thanks for the warm welcome. And you have manners, too. That makes you doubly welcome here. Unfortunately, I got a town to run. Yeah. Where do you enter in your... Entering in its password. Uh, Head on in. Penny's shop is usually the first stop. Over here. No. Hmm. I don't know. There's somebody in there. Hey, Deezer. Can I do something? Less new fruit. Same great taste. Try Deezer's lemonade. Um. I'll take some. Limit one. Okay. Hmm. You. Do you need to use my tools? Alright, I like to sell my on the location of the secret compound. I just need to find its location. It's good to see a new face in Wastia again. Third radio is modern. Ted better get on this pronto. <laughs> I figured as much. Mr. Fitzgerald. We don't tolerate violence or vulgarity. Steer clear of those, and we'll get along just fine. Okay.
harvest here. Concerns non treats our mission as seriously as I do. If only he could do something about his wife. Any fitstrable concern. Mention the sense as undesirables. Altercation with M. Bell. Negative comments about other personnel in other places in Countermouth. Severe reprimand for warning one traitor about the Institute in their ways. Was not extremely effective in her role. I'd suggest she be reassigned to the compound, but she's married to Mr. Fitzgerald, so her permanent posting here is required to be done by frequent enforce reinforcement of our missions and its parameters. Sometimes I feel she cares more about running her store than our goals. Huntley. Possession of contraband on three separate occasions. General antisocial behavior has made visitors uncomfortable. Huntley's new con covenant and given his past, it's understandable that he's jumping. Hopefully over time the community can help him feel safe. If he keeps making visitors feel nervous though, he may need to be reassigned. On the bright side, his reluctive reclusiveness makes him ideal for running messages to the compound. Even when traders are in town, his absence is rarely noticed. Govan visitors comment on her nervousness and jumpiness. She's very compassionate. Could that be a problem? Concerns for her, Miss McGovern, has really come around. Part of her job is to act natural, and if anything, she does it. She overdoes it. I really hope she's truly recovering instead of putting on an act. Even if it is an act, she's utterly indispensable to our operation. None. I have no spell. Looking at her now, you'd have no idea of what she's been through. The only niggling. Detail is that she keeps herself and hasn't integrated into the community, but I suspect she resents being transferred here and would prefer to be working on the core mission. Before she was here, our visitor's number one complaint visitor's number one complaint was the lack of medical services, so we need to at least one doctor here. And unfortunately, her she's the only one qualified that has a suitable temperament. Swanson. Well, if he works directly for the compound and administering this test, and has such no well, idea who he was or how to help him. He keeps himself strictly apart from the community, whether that's his orders or temperament, who's to say? Draft. He has aborted five compound runs due to a fisherman name unknown who has stationed himself as Mystic Pines Pond. Mr. Huntley reports his new favorite fishing hole is directly on top of the compound entrance. This Docton retrieval team was almost spotted by the outsider. I recommend... Okay. Most folks are just looking for a hand. All we gotta do what do we is... have? Dealing with depression, the 12 stages of grief, and some self-help books. Quite the library here. This cell means business. Enjoy your stay. Okay. I will. Hey, a stranger. It's no secret you've been poking around. Not very neighborly of you, if you ask me. I know you think you're doing the right thing. Just don't make any rash decisions you'll regret. Mm. What rash decisions are you talking about? Maybe your next destination doesn't appreciate trespassers. Just come out and say what you mean. Maybe you heard a rumor about Stockton's caravan yeah. a certain compound? So, hypothetically, let's say there's something to it. We wouldn't do anything unless we had good reasons. The best. Okay. Tell you what, you just stop this investigation, and I'll give you a gift. One hundred caps. And then you'd be welcome back here as our friend anytime. Surely there's room for compromise. 
I get Stockton survivors, and we stay friends. I'd have to know more, though. Come on. We can work something out. Please, stranger. Just stay clear of the compound. Mm. Come on. Jacob. Hey, a stranger. It's no secret you've been finding me. Just come out and say, maybe you heard a rumor. We wouldn't do tell you what. Mm -hmm. And then you'd be... Surely there's room for compromise. I get stocked in survivors, and we stay friends. I'd have to know more, though. Please, stranger. Hmm. <laughs> Dan. You find out anything about the caravan? Right. Well, what have you been up to? Not a lot. Everyone's got their eye on me. But I'll keep trying. Maybe I found out something. You bargaining with me? We work as equal partners, or not at all. Fine. The survivors are at some compound. We're in business. I'll meet you there and we'll rescue ourselves some caravan hands. It's no secret you've been poking. Huh? Yeah, shut up. Good caps to be made protected for. Got the best armor in these parts. Yeah. What kind of stuff do you have? I sell armor for Old Man Stockton's outfit, based out of Bunker Hill. Been selling armor to smart wastelanders for years. The dumb ones walk away empty-handed, but they don't stay dumb long. If you catch my meaning. Hmm. I got a few minutes to browse. Got plenty of stock. Take your pick. Let's see what you got. Champion. Ooh. Mantis left. Arm guard. Left arm, left leg. <sighs> Nothing Don't really. Don't know if you got any sense. Too many miles on the road. At least the pay is terrible. Let's see. Eggs, I believe. Oh, go on. Oh, 
you shooting me? Jeez. scavenge for some more of those. That's not creepy at all. Hey, buddy. Don't scare the fish, asshole. Hey. People are mucking around the shore at all hours. Scaring my fish. Go find your own fishing spot. Clear out. See what we got in here. I hate this place. Hey, Dan. Some people up ahead. I'll follow your lead. Same person. You shouldn't have come Must be eliminated. Something's out there. 